Day six, activity one. What fraction of each rectangle is shaded blue? Type the numerator and denominator into the boxes provided. The first is done for you. So this first one was done for you as an example. It says that one sixth is shaded blue. Your job is to figure out what fraction is shaded blue for letters B, C, D, E, and F. The way you do that is look at the fraction or the picture, determine what fraction is shaded, and then go over here where you see the fraction layout for you. Double click into the box and it will let you type whatever number you think belongs in that box for the numerator. Then double click into the box for the denominator and you can type whatever number you think goes in the denominator. Once you've done that, you can move on to the next one. Again, your job is just to double click so that you can activate the box and type into it whatever number you think represents the fraction. Then you can go over to this part. It says letter A represented the fraction 1 6. You can see that over here. In the box below, explain how that model shows 1 sixth. So double click into the box to activate it and then go ahead and type. You could say the model shows, oops, and it's hard to type fractions because you can't have a numerator and denominator exactly on top of each other. So if you wanna type a fraction, go ahead and put the numerator and then type the little forward slash button. And then you can do the denominator. It doesn't look exactly like the fractions we're used to seeing, but that's how we'll know. Once you push spacebar, it will turn into one sixth. The model shows one sixth because, and then you can finish your sentence.